New at six, a candid admission from the mayor of Atlanta. Mayor Kasim Reed says if you need someone to blame for a recent explosion in car break ins and gas station carjackings, you can blame him. Yeah, Reed admits when he pushed the uh, APD to bring down the violent crime rate, the city dropped the ball with property crimes. And Fox Size Morris Stiggs is live tonight in downtown Atlanta with our story. And Morris, now that Reed has acknowledged the problem, how's he planning to fix it? Well, he says it's all about the deployment of resources, and he said he made this decision to take some of the officers here at Zone 2 and the other communities and put them on the violent crime. It's deployment, he says, and now they've already been redirected to tackle the property crime. The responsibility for some of this right. um, is my fault, and I think that the people of Atlanta uh, deserve an explanation. So what is the mayor prepared to explain to all the citizens in Atlanta? He told Fox 5 in an exclusive interview that a rise in car-related and other property crimes can in part be tied to a decision he made this past summer on where to put police resources. We were concerned about the spike in murders. And so we applied overwhelming force uh, to those areas to protect those communities and push back against the number of people who were being killed. That did cause us to pull some of our officers off um, of burglaries, larcenies, car thefts, uh, and other kinds of crime. The murder rate, currently at 88 for the year, has stabilized. It remains 11 ahead of last year this time. So now Reed says there will be a heavier law enforcement concentration on other crimes. Criminals have been so bold, they are literally taking over vehicles at gas stations. Another just happened at a station in Buckhead. Or look at this home camera video from a few weeks ago. Thieves working in the middle of the night taking cars. One resident who lives in a neighborhood struck hard by crime told me friends and family are antsy about even coming to visit her. My mom will actually come and babysit <laughs> and uh, okay, not right. worry about her car sitting on the street. Um, so I, I appreciate him taking, you know, a good look at this. There's a global responsibility here. There is no question that, you know, our women and men uh, are working hard at these problems, but when they capture individuals that are engaged in, gr in violent criminality, the judge needs to slow down and put those folks uh, in jail. The mayor did see one of our earlier stories about the apprehension of six different suspects in car-related crimes. Five of those six got out immediately on signature bonds. He says he wants the court to step up to help the police officers do the job. Reporting live from Buckhead Zone 2, I'm Morris Diggs, Fox 5 News. All right, a lot of components there, Morris. Thanks so much.